Hey everybody, Eric Alvarez on the ground in Chicago, Illinois, AKA the Windy City. It's one of my favorite places in the entire country to explore. But today we're not exploring from down here on the ground, but rather from way up in the sky at the very top of Willis Tower, the eighth tallest building in the world and the tallest building in the Western Hemisphere. Which, spoiler alert, in case it weren't already obvious, this thing is really, really tall, but exactly how high up are we talking? Well, somewhere in the realm of 1,300 feet. To get there, you gotta go to a place called the Sky Deck. It's really easy, just go through the revolving doors, make your way onto the ground floor, and then follow the signs. Are you guys excited? I am really, really excited. I can't wait to see this. But if you wanna get up to the Sky Deck, you're gonna have to buy some tickets, and they run about 30 bucks. Okay, but now we're gonna learn a little bit more about the Willis Tower itself. Let's take a look here. Now, did you know that lightning strikes the Willis Tower anywhere from 50 to 100 times per year? Now that is pretty cool, but when you really think about it with a building that tall, it's kind of not surprising, but how tall is this building really? That's a great question, and according to this graphic, it's 223 Michael Jordans tall. This building is 222,500 tons, which is about the same weight as 1,348 blue whales. Honestly, I can't say I've ever seen anything measured in Michael Jordans and blue whales, but I think it really gets the point across. So obviously so much to learn, so much to see, but the main event, of course, is the Sky Deck. And here we go. I have to wait for the elevator. I was overly excited. Took a little minute, but I'm here, made a pit stop. Final destination, boy, that's the tip top. Small step to a giant boy. Let me feed the peace. Your trip to the Sky Deck will only take about a minute. That means your elevator is traveling at a speed of more than 24 feet per second. Wow. Welcome to the top. <laughs> here we are, everybody. All right, and this over here is the view to the north. Wow, now this is the main event, everybody. This gives you such an amazing perspective of how big this city really is. You can't really appreciate it when you're down on the street, which by the way, you get a lot of culture when you're down there, but there's nothing like this anywhere else. All right, let's get some perspective here on this one because we are 1,353 feet up in the air. How amazing is that? Now check this out, this one's for all of you movie fans. It says, you are standing where Ferris, Cameron, and Sloan were iconically filmed in Ferris Bueller's Day Off, 1986. You know, an experience like this really lets the city leave its mark on you. But now we're gonna check out an opportunity for you to leave your mark in the sky. And you can see people here leaving their names, they're drawing little pictures. Just another example of the interactive nature of this whole experience. It's a small thing, but honestly, it's pretty cool. I really like all of these little touches that they've put into this uh, to really make the experience a memorable one. All right, let's, uh, let's keep exploring, everybody. See what there is to see over here. Oh, here it is, the ledge. Let's go check it out. See, we're snaking our way through. This place brings in more than 1.7 million visitors each and every year. It's one of the most Instagrammable places in all of Chicago. They have a camera overhead that takes your picture. Each box is made up of three layers of half inch thick glass that extend almost four and a half feet away from the skyscraper. And from up here on a clear day, you can see up to 50 miles and four different states. All right, now time is short when you're up here, so I'm gonna have to get going in just a second, but for anyone who's ever wondered if this is something that you should do, I highly recommend it. It's a one of a kind experience. Now, I love Chicago down on the ground, getting to be around all of the people and, and see all of the places there are to see all of the landmarks, but you know, being this high just gives you a perspective you're not gonna see absolutely anywhere else. Some of the most beautiful views of the city you're ever gonna see. It's a great experience.